Well, hello everyone. Welcome back. Josh here with Josh's Lawn and Landscape. Uh, I'm going to try to make it a quick intro today. I'm on my way back to the cemetery property, which I'm almost there, probably a mile from there. So, but uh, uh, left work a little late, just catching up with some stuff. I've mentioned in a previous video before. I think it's just a lot going on. Things have been kind of crazy. Um, got some service stuff that's got to be done to my truck. Um, yeah, so just trying to uh, keep up with the schedule, winding the season down. Um, I'm going to try to get a little bit of uh, real time, possibly time lapse footage uh, today. Uh, even though I'm in, I'm in the cemetery, but there's a couple of open places where I can get uh, some mowing footage and not worry about. Uh, you know having headstones and all that kind of stuff in the uh in the video at least where you know anything can be seen on on them so i try to avoid that but uh so that's where i'm at uh did some mowing out here yesterday i got the main part of the front mowed uh it's pretty good so i haven't done any trimming yet i was going to do some yesterday but uh i think as i mentioned in the video before i uh i had a run in with some sand spurs at uh trying to dig those up and dispose of those and then also um uh, i left early in order to get to my daughter's uh dance class try to catch the last little bit of her uh, at her dance class before it was over yesterday evening, so just kind of go see that. First time I got to do that, so. <laughs> and she did a good job. Um, but that's what's going on. So most of it, a lot of y'all have probably seen this property before. Like I said, it's just uh, it's a three three point one acres, I think, is what this one is. So a little over three. Um, and I'm gonna get out here and start knocking it out. We'll just see what the video turns into. So y'all stick around. All right, y'all. Well, you can see, um, cutting this down to the bottom. So I've already cut from here up, and actually all the way across. But uh, I'm going to start right in this area and get some real time doing this. Uh, what I'm doing is washing wax. So some of y'all always like to say you enjoy seeing how that goes. So basically what I'm doing is making a pass coming this way on the uncut grass and then going over two or three passes and cutting back over it, catch any stragglers. Um, and then kind of pushing the clippings down. So it cleans the clippings up out of the turf. Most of them, you still lose a few here and there. Um, and then you get a good clean cut on the uh, on the turf so you can see going from this to this with the washing wax lawn care washing wax for the wind so you can see I got a couple passes here I'm gonna set my camera up down here hopefully you can still catch it in the shade and uh, I might zoom in from down here because I still got to do all of that um, you see I got the quick track I've already made a couple passes at the back so um, but I'm going to go up here and start and just kind of work my way down and we'll see how it goes so y'all stick around let me get the camera set up and uh, I don't know I might do some time lapse as well alright let's see how it goes
I had a phone call come in, so I had to cut that last bit of footage short. So I think what I'm going to do first is uh, I'm still working on going to work on this section over here. So I'm going to uh, first I'll probably get some time lapse, and then once I get closer down here to the bottom end, I will uh, switch over to some real time, and we'll get some real time uh, wash and wax mold. Y'all stick, stick around. All right, so still got from right in here to obviously right here where you were just watching. So you can see from what it was to what it is. It's not crazy tall, but this stuff is thick, especially this section here. So you're really gonna hear uh, some grunting, pushing this stuff on down because I'm basically trying to push all this all the way to the woods so it wouldn't be quite as bad if i was running the mulching blades i actually have the uh lift style blades just because they cut a little better on the quick track so yeah thanks to uh jason over an american lawn specialist for suggesting that i go back to those trying them out uh but that's where i'm at so i'm gonna try to get some real-time footage here uh, mowing this section and you can see the the shadows are casting it is uh right at 5 30 so hopefully i'll be able to knock this out and um, see if i can get this job finished i may run out of daylight before i get everything we needed but we'll see so i'm gonna try to get some real time here that'll probably be the end of the mowing footage for this video so that i can get into uh getting this one wrapped up but hopefully y'all enjoy it so stick around, we're gonna get it set up. Let's do it.
came from all the way up there that tree so just to give you a little perspective yeah this is a single zoom regular zoom or no zoom whatever you want to call that all the way from that tree up there all of that was pushed all the way down here like you just saw so um, got a pretty good I'd say 95 plus percent of the clippings are probably not even out here they're all down here but now I've got to tackle all the way to the other end so I'm gonna get to working on this hopefully y'all enjoyed it um, so a little bit of time lapse some real time washing wax hopefully y'all enjoyed it uh, I'll be back to close this one out shortly Stick around. Oh, let me add this one in here. Bill, this one's for you. Beautiful blue sky shot. Hopefully y'all enjoyed that as well. Awesome day to be mowing. Whew. All right, y'all. Well, it is just a couple minutes past eight. As you can see, it's dark. My nose is running. I don't know why. Dusty. Um, I'm not quite finished on the cemetery. Everything's mowed and probably 60, 70, 60% eh, 60 of it is weed eated. So I got one, um, one big section to go around all the headstones and stuff. And then um, that's pretty much it. So I'll just have to swing out here tomorrow and finish knocking it out. But just want to wrap this one up real quick um, so I can enjoy my body armor and my cheese peanut butter crackers. So, um, yeah, come across one more sand spur, a uh, little group over there, but uh, luckily I saw it before I got too close with the mower, so I didn't run over that. Got those dug up and uh, boxed or packaged up so I can get them thrown away and uh yeah so that's where i'm at uh quick track did a good job hopefully y'all enjoyed the time lapse and real-time mowing footage from that one section uh it's pretty thick stuff over there but turned out pretty good i think i uh, didn't quite get done like i wanted to but um my wife called me for a little bit. I was talking with her about some stuff, so that cost me probably 20 minutes. And then uh, one of my brothers called, and I hadn't talked to him in a while, so I talked to him for about 15 minutes or so as well. So um, had I not done that, I probably would have been, probably could have got done, but it's okay. Uh, I'm at that point now where um, an extra 45 minutes to an hour uh, one afternoon is not gonna kill me so <laughs> it's the end of the year um, just want to make them make them look good so uh, that's where I'm at with that so see where I'm at tomorrow I'll probably swing straight up here try to get this wrapped up which will be fun because when I get up here it's gonna be hot because I think tomorrow and Friday are supposed to be the two hottest days this week um, so it's gonna be close to the mid 90s tomorrow I think it was 91 90 right at 90 88 90 91 somewhere around an area today so it's pretty warm but that's why i started off with the mowing so that by the time i got to the wheat eating it'd be cooled off um so yep things are going pretty good can't complain i'm doing good if i did um again i mentioned earlier about uh the type of blades i was running on the, the quick track and uh, shout out to uh, Jason and Haley over at American Lawn Specialist. Um, Got to check out some of the videos for uh, Ray. I said, um, getting a couple of videos behind there. Old Ray Ray. He's uh, always out there making it happen. Uh, Randall over at Elite Landscapes Life Stories. Um, Got to see uh, a video today from Ronaldo over at Big Sun. Shout out to Ronaldo also. Uh, he put up a video about, uh, it was entitled 25 years, so maybe he's been in the business that long. We'll see. I haven't watched that one yet, so, Ronaldo, keep at it, brother. Um, 
just want to give a couple of shout outs there um and i uh, hadn't done it in a while but also chris over at chopping blades check him out just recently did a video where i think he bumped into another lawn care guy kind of did an interview there it's a pretty cool video so chris keep chopping brother and uh hope everything's going good for you i know you're looking to get that stander man so hopefully that happens for you uh end of this year first of next year be excited to see it but uh keep on brother and yeah that's pretty much it i'm gonna hit the road get back to the house it's dark get my snack and when i get back i need some coffee so um as always thank y'all for watching thank you to everybody who has subscribed i think i got two new subs today welcome to the channel thank y'all for the support everybody who's commented and liked the videos um just really appreciate it i always want to put that in the video at least once and let y'all know that um if you haven't had the opportunity yet and you've watched a couple of videos, um, hit that subscribe button at the bottom. Leave me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. So, thank y'all. Appreciate it. As always, y'all be safe. Be kind. Be blessed. Catch you on the next one. Thanks, everybody.